Hey guys, John here with Vapor Honing Technologies. Today we are prepping the surface for a ceramic thermal dispersant coating. Uh, we've been working with thermal dispersant coatings here for a couple days now and uh, the purpose of the coating itself is to get heat away from a part to keep the part cool um, so that it performs better for a longer period of time. Um, for vintage motorcycle engines in particular, it's very important these engines are mostly air-cooled, um, so they need all the help they can get from a cooling standpoint. Um, today we're showing you how to prep the surface on a fairly dirty part, um, how quick and easy this can be, how there's no degreasing involved if you're going to be prepping the surface for a coating. Um, we're going to be getting a really good anchor profile using a ver uh, actually a medium mesh aluminum oxide. It's going to be a 120 mesh to get a good profile here. And for those of you that don't know what profile is, profile is basically a tooth or a peak in a valley. So you can imagine if this is the peak in the valley of the surface, you want that so that the coating sits down inside of the valley and mechanically locks uh, so that you have really good adhesion. Otherwise, if the surface is smooth, the coating has no area to go into to actually lock into and, and create a good bond. So what we're doing is we're creating a profile. We're not overly aggressive here, uh, but we're cleaning and we're getting a good profile. And again, clean is important as well as the profile. Um, if you have grease or oil on the surface, that's going to tarnish and contaminate our finish and of course our coating that, and it will not adhere to the surface. So um, we're going to put this in the machine and show you how quick and easy this can be, so stay tuned. Okay guys, back after vapor blasting or wet blasting this piece, we prepped the surface, we cleaned it extremely well, we give it a really nice surface profile, we etched it very, very good, and of course it was degreased very well in the wet blasting machine so that we could put a very good coating on the piece and it would adhere very well. Um, of course, this is just an incredible process for multiple applications and this is a really good example of that. Um, if you guys are using Cerakotes or coatings from Techline, any of the ceramics, these are incredible after a process such as this. It's going to drastically increase your profits and increase your time from point A to point B. When you get this part in its unfinished raw nature, you can prep this piece very quickly and easily and get it back to the customer. So increase your, you're increasing your profits. But very clean process, very low cost, low maintenance for doing applications such as this coating prep. If you guys have questions, please email us, give us a call. Uh, we're here to help, and thanks for watching.